So let's go back to the 1980s when a Xerox copier took up an entire room. <laughs> there was another park scientist, Lucy Suchman, and she had the idea that maybe if you're building technology for people, you should watch them using it. So she decided to watch some people using a Xerox copier. She grabbed a couple of her colleagues from down the hall, and she asked them to make copies. Place one to 50 originals. Well, wait a minute, I have 100 originals. We want two-sided copies. Unload top paper tray. What? Reverse order the originals? You've got to be kidding. Yeah. This is definitely a bug. Press start. that relate to that? Unload top, top paper tray. We didn't tray. do that. That's not this. That's not the paper tray. It doesn't say what the paper tray is, huh? So our, our first batch, our first batch, is SOL. What is that? Shit out of So it turns out that those two people from down the hall are world-renowned computer scientists. One of them went on to win the equivalent of the Nobel Prize in computer science. <laughs> So clearly the problem is not that the people are dumb, the problem is with the design of the copier. PC load letter? What does that mean? No, not again. I... Why does it say paper jam when there is no paper jam? I swear to God, one of these days I, I, I just kick this piece out the window. You and me both, man. I think it's lucky I'm not armed. <laughs>